I watched a documentary on Paul Watson, and it's called, on YouTube this is by the way, and it's called Paul Watson, The Whale Warrior, A Pirate for the Sea. I recommend watching that, it's very good stuff if you're into animal activism, environmentalism, etc, animal rights. Um, this guy's a bit of a hero, you know, when it comes to um, stopping illegal whaling um, and other illegal activities in the fishing industries. Um, he tried to, to stop some of the, um, the, the cubs, um, the slaying of the cubs, you know, out in, in Canada with the seal pups. Oh my god, that's terrible, it's awful, it's just, um, it's poor little, it's poor little fuckers, man, it's poor little seals. They're just so gentle, they're so, their little eyes, they're just so gentle souls, they're so gentle, these little pups, seal pups, and these humans, man, they're just going out and just smashing these pups on the head. Um, to get their pelts, it's just horrific. So these uh, men uh, going round smashing these poor little seal pups heads in and um, so uh, Paul Watson, well actually Paul Watson isn't allowed to leave a ship I don't think, something like that. So the others go out and try and stop these men from um, hitting these seals and killing these seals and skinning them and getting their pelts. Um, and the the, the whales, the, yeah, and going back to that, the attitude of these people is just the human, these humans, some human beings, the attitude is just so bad. So bad. Um, <clears throat> and he also tries to stop the illegal whaling out in Japan by ramming the, um, the boat, the whaling boats that are harpooning these poor, beautiful whales. Um, for research, it's just all illegal, but it's all the, the government's turned my eye anyway. So, so big respect to, to Paul Watson, um, Sea Shepherd crew, and organisation. Um, amazing stuff they do. The only the only thing that did get me a little bit was like there's a bit in the film where he's like kind of celebrate. I think it's his birthday, and. He's got all his family and friends around and they're kind of panning around and thinking, yeah, vegan food, because he's into veganism obviously, vegan food, rice and vegan stuff, and, uh, and then it pans around to the barbecue, thinking, oh yeah, yeah, okay, corn on the cob, and then it goes to lobsters, <laughs> like, they think, well, what are they going to do with lobsters? It's for, you know, it's, it's for, like, not killing stuff in the ocean, leaving the ocean alone, leaving all the, and they've got these lobsters and put them on the barbecue, it's like, what? <laughs> the, what? I don't get it. I thought he was about like saving the lobsters, saving the fish, saving the whales, saving the marine life. And then he's like letting his family do lot. I'd be like, no, it's a lobster free zone. It's a marine life free barbecue. You know, it's just plants here and stuff like that. But that's the only bit that fucks me. It's like, you're fighting for marine life. Why are you putting lobsters on the barbecue? But fantastic documentary. I recommend it. Um, yeah, brilliant stuff there. Sea Shepherd. I think I'm going to get myself a Sea Shepherd hoodie, beanie, and t shirt to support the guys because they're doing an amazing job. Amazing job. If they don't do it, who the fuck's going to do it? The government isn't interested. Governments aren't interested. People aren't interested. So you need these people to do something, you know, 